Hey guys, it's Eddie, and welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me um, in a Friday night in my life. Like today, it's gonna be a little different. It's kind of chill, like we don't have any plans. So, so today might just be like a boring Friday. It's fine though, because these Fridays, like we just stay home and like we, oh, do you have a game? No, there's nothing, I see. Why? Oh, the boat? The boat show. Yeah. So like we don't have any games and until tomorrow. So we're just gonna chill today. I don't know if we're gonna go anywhere else. But right now me and my dad are on our way to go check out some uh, couches because we kind of want to buy um, some new sofas. So I'm planning on baking today. You know it's a little different. I don't normally bake, but since like today's like no plans and like we're not really doing anything, um, I do have the time to do that. So I think I'm gonna do that when I get home because the place is like right here, like two minutes away so and my dad's just gonna go and see them and then obviously talk to my mom about it so so today was actually like a really good day at school we had like a pep rally i remember i said in my last vlog if you guys haven't watched my last vlog of a school day in my life go ahead and watch that but i did say that i was gonna vlog the pep rally today um i ended up not and i kind of regret it but but i feel like it was kind of I just felt like it was a little better than the first one I had at the beginning of the year. So I felt like this one was actually like my real pep rally. So then like I just like wanted to like just like see and like experience it like like in the moment instead of like recording. So next one which is the spring which is not that far. I'm definitely gonna record for sure because I actually now know what a pep rally feels like or whatever. Because the first one was like my first one at um like as a freshman so like I was just like kind of out of it and like didn't really know what to expect so this one actually felt like it was I was actually kind of excited for the pep rally so that's why I didn't really vlog but like I said if you guys haven't watched my recent videos I'll put them in the description so you guys can go ahead and watch those okay guys so like they don't really have that many things like this store is really small but like it, it, okay let me rephrase that they do have a good amount of selections that fit in the store because this store is really small so like they have a few and we want my dad like wants really specific ones like he wants leather couches that recline because ours right now are like a cloth material or like you know like that just like a regular like spongy couch and as the years went like they, they just kept getting dirty and dirtier so now we want the ones that are like leather so they don't get dirty as easy as the ones that we have now and we also want some that recline because ours don't at the moment so like we want a little change. I'm just chilling here because he asked me if I wanted to come with him. And um, I initially, initially, does that make sense? I first said no, but then like I felt bad because he was coming by himself. So I came and I get to try out these couches. And this one's actually really soft and like really comfortable. Like, <sighs> like oh, guys, so I had volleyball open gym today for my school, but I have not been feeling the best and I feel super tired. So like right now, like this feels so good and I could just take a nap. So yeah, so yeah, we're gonna finish up here, go back home, and like I said, I might bake. And I'm gonna make beignets, which do take a, like the process of ingredients don't take a while, but like, yeah, they'll set them aside, so. All right, all right so I'm back home now. I'm gonna be um, making my beignets, so. I'm gonna go ahead and get started. All right guys, so change of plans. Uh, I guess I'm gonna bake later tonight because I didn't know where we're gonna go out to eat for dinner. So I have to hurry up and get ready in like five minutes because we're leaving at six and it's like 5.52. Let me go ahead and get changed. So yeah, and again, we don't really know where we're going. So this is kind of like a surprise. So now we're at Target and we're basically just like walking around but now like I'm coming in here and I low-key want a whiteboard 
But I can't find them, guys. Right here. It should be here. No. They're not. I literally just look. Yeah, I don't want one super expensive. Because, like, why am I going to get super expensive one? I just want, like, a little, like, like a small one, you know? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I don't know. I'm going to keep looking. But I can't find anything, so. <laughs> Lottie's going to be running away from me right now. Dude. <laughs> So right now, I feel like we were just playing volleyball. She like down balled me in the aisle. And so I picked it up and it went to like the side aisle and it broke the shelf. Oh, it didn't break it, just took it off the shelf but it made a lot of noise. So we like, I feel like we used like, this one before. So we picked up everything and we like, left. But we did pick it up, we didn't just leave it there. So now we're just hiding. Little, like we came into the cleaning aisle. <laughs> but it was so because like, I should have vlogged that, but you know. After here, we for sure are going home, and I, I'm actually happy because I still want to bake. <sighs> okay, so now we're finally home, and then I think I'm either gonna continue baking, but I don't know because that is a process, and it's already like 10 uh, 9 30. So, but if not, I'll make it tomorrow. I think we're gonna chill as a family because Mateo just fell asleep in the car, so he's you know, like out for the night, and then Emma, I think, is really tired, so she's gonna head to bed. I'm actually really tired. Um, I barely got any sleep last night and like today I've just been feeling like crap. So all right guys, so right now I'm gonna go ahead and start baking. Like I said, I didn't know I was gonna do this right now, but it's the weekend, doesn't matter. And I think I said this earlier, but I don't normally do this obviously every Friday. So like this is like because I had a lot of time, I decided to do this. And today was, you know, a lot. It felt today was really long. I feel like baking, like surprisingly, actually like helps me like wind down and like just make me just helped me think and like I just drift into thought and like I don't know it just like calms me and um not a lot of people like know that about me but yeah I do bake and then I love to see the looks on people's faces when like they try my stuff so anyways I'm gonna go ahead and get started I have all my ingredients right here um I have my milk I have my egg I have my yeast I have my sugar I have my butter I have my flour and I have this batch a little. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, and yeah. Mickey beignets. I'm gonna go give them out to my parents. Lani, I think, is still awake, so I'm gonna go downstairs and bring her some. But I just finished cleaning up all my mess because, you know, it did take a while, so let's go bring them out to my parents. You guys wanna try them with me? <laughs> oh, oh, Eddie, they look so cute. What the heck happened to this one? <laughs> uh, those were like extras that I made into squares instead of Mickey's. So I'm gonna bring some to Lani. But that did take a while. It was really good though. Waiting. Yeah, no, yeah, the, the process isn't long at all. It's just you gotta wait two hours for it to inflate. Really good, Eddie. Uh, thanks. Wow, looks like, like So now I'm just currently like cleaning up the last bit of my mess. Um, I did make a whole lot of them. There's like a whole plate over here. Then there's like another like two of these. Look like, those look like croissants. There's like another one on this plate. Okay, so I made a lot. 
I think I might store those though, even though beignets are only good when like you make them. Like they may last like maybe another day if you're lucky. But like beignets, they are only good when like they're fresh. So my mom says we could save them for tomorrow morning because like my parents drink coffee every morning, you know, who doesn't? They're going to eat them when they have um, their coffee tomorrow morning because they really like them. Lonnie, when I went downstairs to go show Lani the beignets and she was already half asleep but then she like sprung out of bed just to try them so that made me really happy and because Lani had like a whole entire beignet so did my parents and I was like wow so I didn't expect them actually to taste that good like I'm not gonna try and brag but like I didn't think that they were gonna come out that way and they came out so fluffy like look at this one this one's so blumptious like it's actually too blumptious like I'm just like what but anyways, so that now it's 1230. Now I'm like super tired because one, I think I mentioned this, but I didn't get that much sleep last night. And two, today has been just such a long day and I can't wait to lay down in bed and um, reflect on my day and hopefully sleep well tonight because I need it. So with that being said, I hope you guys liked coming along with me on my Friday night. And I know this probably wasn't what you guys were expecting of a Friday night, but this is pretty much what it's like for our family when like we don't have any soccer games. We just like to chill or like do the most randomest things. Everything today was just so random and I couldn't be more grateful. But anyways, with that being said again, uh, I will see you guys on the next video. I love you guys so, so much. Stay positive. Bye guys.